Howdy folks, Luke Simons with you here from North Dakota, rancher. We took a trip to Oklahoma. We went and visited Jim Lynch's place in Oklahoma. The Basics of Lime Breeding. He is the author. Um, excellent book. I would think every rancher should have this in his library. Um, lime breeding is not inbreeding. It's a more consistent breeding. However, I just want to say this before we get too far into the video. Line breeding can breed in good traits as well as bad traits. Two frame score animals all across the board, no exception. Anxiety 4 bull was the first Hereford bull in the United States, and um, lamplighter bulls, etc. And Jim has never pulled away from these animals. Um, he's always line bred back to these animals. These, in fact, these his animals are line bred for almost a hundred years. So um, just want to show you what I seen at his ranch. This is an accurate, um, pretty much all the cattle look the same. Tabletop backs. Um, I am not saying negative things about the cattle. I, I'm going to let you judge um, the animals for yourself. Um, really the video is more about line breeding than it is his cattle. So um, I'll probably get a lot of comments. And feel free to leave comments. At the end of this video, I'm going to tell you how to get a hold of Jim's book for you. Look at the hair coat on these animals. That's one thing I noticed about them. They had a good hair coat. The bull had a lot of curl, which is a sign of masculinity. Um, good hair coat, but the hair coming out of those ears, I, I'm a winter grazer, and um, that, that usually is a sign of good hair on those animals when they have hair sticking out of the ears. And all these animals do. Jim and his wife are absolutely beautiful people to, to talk to and to get to, to know. Um, I also wanted to mention too, if you take a look at those fleece waters on those cows, they still have the long tail like traditional old cattle do. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel.